Hey everybody, good morning. Time to get started with your Tuesday. And you're in the right place to do that right here at 7 minutes in the morning, right after this. Hey everybody, good morning. My name is Tom Rigsby, your host for the next, uh, I don't know, seven-ish minutes or so. I think I should change the name on iTunes to seven-ish minutes in the morning. Anyway, uh, this is a show where we get together every morning and talk about how to help you have a happy, healthy, balanced life. Today, we're on uh, number six, I think. Yeah, number six of the seven. Uh keys to having that happy, healthy, balanced life. And uh, so look, if you are with me this morning when you're watching, and it, and look, and it doesn't matter, watching live or on the replay, it's okay either way. I like it just to know that you're here. Drop me a comment down in the comments. Let me know that you're here and watching. That kind of makes my day. And it helps you because that tells Facebook that you want to keep up with the conversation that goes on down the comments long after. The video is wrapped up. All right, so today we're talking about number six out of the seven. So far we've talked about managing your time, taking care of your health, those important relationships, your emotional labor, and yesterday was activity or alignment, whichever A you preferred. I kind of like alignment. Today we're going to talk about dun, 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 development. Oh, a bit hissy today, says, uh, well, let's see, says Keith. I've got a bunch of stuff running in here this morning. I even have the heater turned on. Maybe that's it. Um, I don't know. We'll just have to go with it today. If it's too much to listen to, the uh, the post-production will take it out, and uh, the replay should sound better. Okay, so today, the D, we want to talk about the, uh, the D of development. There's only two states that you can exist in, growth or decay. Personally, I'd rather be growing than rotting. I know, that's gross. I'm sorry. But the point is that you, you can't stay in one place. Time, because time moves continuously, right? Time's always moving. And it seems like it's about that fast, too, doesn't it? Time's always moving. And so where we were at one point begins to decrease as time continues to move. So we have to have this sense of continuous development, continuous improvement, always growing. What's the easiest way to do that? Now, uh, I'm going to go ahead and say it, and then we'll come back and talk about it. These guys right here. Look at all, just think about this for just a second. If it only took a year... For the authors to write each one of those books. Two, three, four, five, six. I mean, that's probably ten years worth of knowledge right there on that bookcase. I mean, wait, a year? No. It would be more than that. A year, twelve, six, sixty years worth of knowledge ish on that bookcase. And you get to have it for just the cost of sitting down and reading it. Now, reading might not be your thing. Get Audible. Read them on the Kindle. Uh, watch videos. Whatever it is, find a topic and study the topic. Keep your brain in the learning mode because one of the, the things, uh, and I'll have to look this article up and link to it, <coughs> uh, differences between um, wealthy people and poor people. And one of the differences that the author pointed out is that Wealthy people continue to learn. Poor people think they, that learning ends at the end of school. Right? So there's always, there are always new things being discovered. There are always new things that we can learn. And keeping our brain in that learning mode so that we remember to learn, that it's just, we remember how, and it's just part of our daily routine, that's super important. Right over there, that's over this, yeah, this shoulder, this shoulder, right there. That's uh, the, our oldest granddaughter, because she's the one that can talk, calls up, you know, Pop's big red chair. And that's where I sit every morning, 
I write a little bit, I read a little bit, listen to a book, do something to get that new information packed in there in the skull because that's just super important. All right, so development, that is one of the seven areas that are key to having a happy, healthy, balanced life. If you remember, happiness comes from progress. Progress is a result of execution. If you are not taking in new ideas or even rereading ideas that have been around for a little while, that progress muscle begins to atrophy. It begins to shrink, and you can't execute. You can't see things that other people see. One of the things I tell you all the time, entrepreneurs, business owners, we see opportunity where other people see obstacles. Why is that? Because we've studied what other people have experienced. And by having that knowledge, by having gone through that development, we can see things that other people can't. That's what sets us apart. It's that simple. All right. Short show today because today is Tuesday. That means it's radio show day. That's coming up at the top of the hour. And i got to hustle to get from here over to the radio station to do that show. Um, but stick with me. That will be an interesting show today. You can watch that at TalkRadioForEntrepreneurs.com. That takes you to the right Facebook page. I uh, would appreciate it if you'd come over there and watch the show. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for being here. Uh, I will be back again tomorrow, and we'll wrap this up. Day will be day number seven of the seven keys. Happy, healthy, balanced life. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Have a terrific Tuesday.